along with my dear other brother, amen, who's with us, amen, and by his leading brother, who's going to do the major and master introduction, and introduce the spirit, amen. That's why Minister Michael Mills comes to us once a year, amen, to exercise the spirit, the spirit of celebration and freedom. Would you, all youth and all alike, amen, get yourselves together, amen, all of us, let's give ourselves the attention to one of our celebrant worshipers this morning, amen, Brother Michael Mills. Let's give him a hearty St. James. Welcome.
worship service has been in its spirit, and I celebrate today. I want to welcome the men of our church and the fathers of our church. I, I have a lot to be grateful for by being a part of such a spiritual and great family of God called the St. James Missionary Baptist Church. Our ministry and our lives have been richer when we weekly come together and become one in the spirit. Amen. I appreciate the fact that we have heart here. I heard us chant a few moments ago, heartbeat, God speaks. I love the fact, just to see, that we have heart here. That when one hurts, we all hurt. When one is sick, we all are sick. When one is lonely, we all long for love. And when one rejoices, we all rejoice. I thank God for you, St. James. Also, I want to thank God for such a gift this morning as I found when I came to church this morning. Amen. And opened up our bulletin. Was able to see even a memory page of great men, great fathers who worship right here with us. Do y'all have the same program? Yes. We thank God for just that reflection. But I thank God for the living stone. I thank God for the men and the fathers of the church who are present here today. You continue to represent your families and say, as for me and my house, we will, I will serve the Lord. Amen. amen. I was blessed this morning. Amen. Have my father with me. Happy Father's Day, Dad. Amen. Fathers of St. James, I welcome you at this time. Come and stand with us as we celebrate the goodness of God upon our lives. Deacon Hood, Lord bless you. Amen. Happy Father's Day. My brother, God bless you. Come right on. This is our day of encouraging one another in the Lord. The Lord bless you. Sharpest man in the church every time he steps in. Brother Glenn, the Lord bless you. God bless you. He told me, call me Grandpa. I've been leaning on him as one. You love me so much. I love you. God bless you. Say the same, my Brother Lord. We miss you, but we have you back. Alright. 
praise God and say to you, Amen. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Oh, happy day. Happy Father's Day. Yes. Amen. We thank you, your Father's here to say happy birthday. Happy Father's Day to another. Amen. My father's gone. Yeah. My lot of father's gone. But I still say to him, Happy Father's Day. Amen. Amen. Somewhere he fears me and what I'm saying. I'm a father of many. I'm a grandfather of many. And I'm a great grandfather of many. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Amen. 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 Praise God. To my left. I just would like to say love. That's all God is. Love. And I want to share my love with all of you. Amen.
once a year. And I don't know how many of you have been on your job at least six years, but you know, even if you have these trials and tribulations and sometimes you want to leave, imagine, have you ever thought about what would happen if the pastor decided that he no longer wanted to shepherd the sheep? Have you ever thought about that? Have you ever experienced being without a shepherd? Just food for thought. And, and, and I recall that the, the Bible says, and you can read it for yourself, that he's the shepherd of your soul. That's what it says in the word. The shepherd of your soul. That's a powerful statement. Your soul. So if we can just acknowledge the shepherd of this house. See, I don't know about you all, but I lean and depend on Jesus. But when he gives you a prophet, the Bible also talks about a prophet's reward. I don't know if you ever experienced that, but a prophet can give you a blessing. So if we could just take this time out to recognize the prophet, the angel of this house, the shepherd of your soul. Amen. 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 Oh, amen. Thank you. And you all, please forgive my etiquette. You all may be seated. Amen. And please forgive me, it's just a, um, uh, um, I guess it's my, the way that I was reared and, or raised. But if you all can stand there and pass, I'm going to ask if you can go um, step down. For, forgive me. That's, you know, I can hear my grandmother in the back of my head. Like, hold up, wait a minute. I'm sorry, forgive me. Amen.